Hello, my name is Chris and welcome to Ewa English. In today's video, we're going to be doing a quiz. Who doesn't love a quiz? In this quiz, we're talking about Great Britain. So, in the comments, let me know from 1 to 10, how much would you like to meet the Queen? 10 being the highest. Anyway, don't forget to subscribe and let's get going. Today we're going to do a quiz. Okay, today we're going to do a quiz. The first part, we're going to have a look at some vocabulary related to the UK, which includes some situations. And then after that, we're going to do a general quiz. Okay. All right, here we go. A tired Brit, a British person, might say, I'm peckish, I'm knackered, I'm sparky. Good, it is knackered. Remember, the K is silent. The K is silent. It's knackered. Okay, knackered. Um, at a or at an English restaurant, you want British fries. You ask for which one? Chips, crisps, or bickies? It is A. Chips. Chips. Okay, okay, crisps you find in a packet. They're like a snack that you can have as you're walking or for your lunch. Whereas chips are, well, you get them in a restaurant usually or from a chippy, which is a, a fish and chip restaurant, a chippy. Okay, uh, and they're hot. Okay, uh, and Bickies, does anyone know Bickies? What's Bickies? So Bickies are biscuits. Right, we, we just kind of shorten things in the UK sometimes like, ah, oh, do you have any bickies? I fancy a biscuit. If you cut your finger in the UK, you should ask for a conker, a spanner or a plaster. What do you think? A plaster, a plaster. All right, a person who loves eating toad in the hole, enjoys a game that's similar to golf, visiting gardens, or sausage baked in pastry. Hmm. Toad in the hole. What the hell is it? Toad in the hole. So, yeah, exactly. So well, toad in the hole is sausage baked in pastry. It's kind of a, I don't know, a, <laughs> It's like a weird, like a sausage in the middle, uh, just plunged in the middle of the, the, uh, the pastry or the pie. All right. If you are shopping for sneakers, for sneakers, man, in London, you should ask for wellies, trainers or smalls. Trainers. It is indeed trainers. Smalls, uh, it's, well, it's just a, a fake answer. C is kind of just fake. It doesn't mean anything. What's wellies? So if it's raining outside, you wear your wellies. The long word is Wellington boots. Wellington boots. A British babysitter is known as lollipop lady, minder, busker. B, it is indeed B, a minder. Okay, we say a minder in the UK. Um, just remember, guys, before we finish off uh, the first part of the quiz, the, the next two questions, just remember we're all here because of EWA, right? The lovely application EWA. I don't know if anyone's used their application who's here in this live today. If you haven't, why the hell not? Go download it. You can find it on Google Store or Apple Store, whatever phone you prefer to use. Um, go check it out. Right? They have a free version. You can try it out. See if you're compatible. If you enjoy it, you can go further. You can go to the premium section. If not, just keep chilling out with the, uh, the free version. Uh, but the main thing is you download it. Check out the books. It's brilliant, okay? I really um, promote it because I've tried it myself and I think it's brilliant. Obviously, 
<laughs> I've just tried it with English, but not to learn, just to see, like, oh, this is an interesting way to teach. So you should do the same, okay? You should check it out, have a bit of fun. Because if you're not having fun, you're not learning. That's, the, that's, that's my ethos. That's my,、uh, my strong belief, okay? And Ewa is a place you can have a lot of fun and learn at the same time. Okay, so download Eba, 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 Ewa, Ewa. Okay, all right, a lot of love. Okay, let's continue with the quiz. If an Englishman says he needs a biro, give him some gum, a ballpoint pen, or your umbrella. Hmm, which one is it? Which one is it? It is indeed B. Okay, a ballpoint pen. I mean, it's even difficult for me to say a ballpoint pen. I, I've, this is probably the first time I've ever said a ballpoint pen. Normally, you say, You've got a biro. You've got a biro. Mum, I need a biro. I've got to write down someone's address. Okay, or a pen as well, yeah. The last one If a Brit tells you, if a Brit tells you they want to have a flat, or they have, they have a flat, It means they want to eat dinner, they want a latte, or they live in an apartment. Hmm, which one is it? Okay, so in the UK, we say flat. We don't normally say apartment. I mean, people will understand you, understand you.、Uh, it's not a problem, but、um, we normally say flat. Like I, I live in a flat at the moment. Okay. All right, let's go to、uh, another quiz I have about general、um, things in the UK. Ba -da -ba -ba, the great British quiz. The great British quiz. All right, it's not that great, but it's okay. The, it's, it should be called the OK, the average British quiz. <laughs> okay. The OK British quiz. Which country? In the UK, is not part of Great Britain. This is a very important one because there is a difference between Great Britain and the UK. There is a difference. Which country is not a part of Great Britain? The UK is,、uh, so the UK is Northern Ireland, Scotland, Wales. England, Northern Ireland, not the Republic, not the Republic. There's different, there's two Ireland's, don't forget. Northern Ireland, Scotland, Wales, England. Great Britain is just the island, okay? So it, the, the single islands. Wales, Wales, Scotland, England. Wales, Scotland, England. Northern Ireland is not included in Great Britain. What is the union? Ah, I just I almost told you. I almost told you. What is the UK flag often known as? The Union. What is it? What is it? I, I told you half of it. The Union. The Union Jack. Exactly. The Union Jack. What is the population of the UK? Which one do you think? Got some multiple choice for you now. What do you guys think? Which one? A, B, C, or D? Hmm. It is, in fact, D. D. More than 65. At the moment, it, apparently, based on statistics, it's 67 million. 67 million people live in that tiny island. Crazy. Who is the current queen? What is her name? What is her name? Okay, what is her name? Elizabeth Alexandra Mary Windsor. It's, pretty, it's, a, it's a mouthful, isn't it?、Oh, Elizabeth Alexandra Mary Windsor. Wow. But which country has the most foreigners in England? Which do you think? Are there more Chinese in England? Are there more Indians in England? Are there more French people or are there more Germans? What do you, what do you think?
It is B. Indians. Do you, do you know how many Indians are in are in England? I googled it because I wasn't sure. I checked, and it's way above all the other ones. Like China, apparently there are a hundred and fifty thousand Chinese people living in England. French and Germany, it was something like a hundred thousand. But Indians, one point four million, one point four million Indians living in England. That's insane. So many. Where or what is this? Where or what is this? Or maybe you can just tell me where it is. Where is it? It is Oxford University. So it's in Oxford. Brilliant. All right. Well, I hope you found that really interesting. So be ready to practice English, and、uh, I'll see you then. Take care, guys. Thank you so much.